Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Big Brain Cowboy coming at you with a quick little tutorial on how to fix a little finicky problem I was having. And now this applies when you're playing Red Dead Redemption 2 on uh, Steam and you're wanting to use a Nintendo Switch Pro Controller as your primary controller. Uh, so what the problem is, is while, you, while you're playing the game and you press the L1 button or the L bumper button or the you know L1 to open up your, your items menu, when you go around the wheel, you can go to the right, top right, bottom right, or same with the left side, left, but, but you can't hit up and you can't hit down. If I go in a circle, it kind of skips those areas. And uh, I thought it was an issue with my blue, since I'm doing this off Bluetooth uh, with a connect connectivity issue, but apparently it, it's not. This has a really, really simple fix that you can do in a matter of seconds. It took me hours to figure this out, but uh, here's what you do. You don't have to you don't have to go to your big picture mode and mess with anything there. You don't have to install X360C. You don't have to mess with any of that. Here, all you have to do is go into your Steam library. Oh, uh, click on Red Dead Redemption. Ah, library, Red Dead Redemption. And then you click on controller configuration right here. You go to the right. Uh, joystick move here go to a don't mess with anything you go to additional settings don't mess with anything again just go straight here to the sensitivity area for whatever reason I don't know if this is a universal problem or just a problem that I was encountering you want to go here with the vertical sensitivity vertical scale and just make sure it matches to the horizontal scale about right there you just hit back back done close out of this back into the game and I press L1 and bam, look at that. Everything is unlocked. Up, down, left, right, corners. Everything is fixed. So I hope that helps in case any of y'all were having the same problem that I was having and making the game very annoying while playing on the Switch Pro Controller. Um, hopefully it takes care of it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.